back to my channel my name is Jay and today I'm going to be showing you a pair of Nike sneakers okay that came out around the same time the Air Jordan 1 and the Nike Dan came out so um, let's take a look so today I'm going to be talking about the Nike Terminator High and these came out in 1985 that was the same year the Nike Jordan 1 also came out I believe these had some uh, inspiration from the Jordan 1 and the Nike Dunk because they all came out around the same time so you can tell some similarities between these and the Jordan 1 I have a pair of Jordan 1 here to show you so this is one of the two Jordan 1 highs that I personally own and if we put the two together we can see the similarities you know between them uh, yeah it's obvious how one got the inspiration you know from the other so when the Terminator high came out it was made for basketball and over the years the Terminator high has found its way into you know culture and fashion so today you can wear these casually you can wear them wherever you want to go depending on how you style them let's talk about some of the details on the shoe the majority of the shoe is covered in white leather but we have the snake skin you know pattern the snake skin leather going on and these are not real snake skins okay these were not uh, obtained from you know any snakes but these are just imitations these are like a design okay so we have the snake skin leather around the toe box at the forefront of the shoe and we also have the same leather on the eyelets of the shoe as well on both sides of the shoe now going to the back okay at the back of the heel we have the same snake skin nicely put together with the bites there on both sides of the shoe we have the nike logo well cut out okay in black really nice black laces now going to the back of the shoe we have nike printed bold over there and let me show you both shoes so that's how it looks and i don't know how i feel about you know the nike uh, being at the back you know as huge as it is i don't know because it's kind of in your face and that's not how i like to you know dress up so um yeah but i believe that's how the classics you know were made around that time so nike decided to keep it original you know keep it you know just like the classics so um on the mix of the sneakers seal colorway Kind of off white creamy you know yeah kind of off white creamy color really nice you know just to keep this uh you know like just to give it some vintage vibe and i think nike did really well you know by adding that color to the entire thing so this colorway is the coco snake skin colorway so let's go to the bottom of the shoes black rubber as you can see good traction okay for the basketball court and you know around the toe of the midsole we have you know the stars if you can see so yeah inside of the shoe is well padded with mesh material on the inside well padded very soft to give you that extra comfort on the court or wherever you are wearing these two and also on the tongue it's well padded okay like good cushioning in the tongue as well you know very thick and on the tongue we have the nike swoosh there as well as you can see it doesn't say nike air it says nike and yeah um yeah that's just something to notice so um the quality is very good the materials used are you know um good materials it's gonna last it's gonna be uh i mean they are durable materials it's not flimsy it's not gonna break anytime soon also the back heel as you press you know it doesn't move or anything so it keeps your uh, it keeps your feet locked in yeah so generally these are well made okay 
is the Nike Terminator. Also, these come in uh, low top as well. These come in low top, but I don't you know how I feel about them. I don't think I like them to be honest. Alright, guys, so if you made it to this point of the video, I just want to say thank you and um, please like, subscribe, and comment what you think about these. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.